please subscribe to this channel and also tap the notification bell in order for you not to miss out on any of our videos. When Emmanuel Macron, the young French president, visited Cameroon some time back, many suspected that he was up to no good. For many months now, there have been secret discussions at the Unit Palace on who should succeed Bia, Cameroon's ailing and desperately old president who has been in power for 40 years but has nothing to show for his long stay in power. As Mr. Bia's health continues its relentless march towards the tubes, his inner circle is working closely with the French government on the possibility of making Frank Bia, the ruthless dictator's eldest son, the country's next president. According to a source at the Unity Palace who elected anonymity, the plan to hand over power to Frank Bia is almost complete, and the French have put their seal of approval on the plan, even though they fear it could trigger a civil war in the country. However, Cameroonians, both at home and abroad, are not waiting for this vile plan to be put in place before they can start scrambling desperately for a solution. In Paris, France, the country's diaspora descended on the French National Assembly on the 30th of August in a bid to nip the plan in the bud. In a video which has been trending on social media, thousands of Cameroonians could be heard singing Non au pouvoir gré à gré au Cameroon, which translates as No to a negotiated transfer of power in Cameroon. This situation is embarrassing to the French and many of the country's lawmakers are calling on their government to distance itself from a collapsing dictatorship which is costing the country tons of money and opportunities. The French know that in the event of a free and fair election in Cameroon, the country's population will overtly reject any French-leaning government and this could cost the French their vast economic interests. This is a developing story. Stay tuned and more will be yours.